Welcome to IUSC TV. We're here this week with our NPL head coach, Daniel Marmer. Daniel, welcome. Thanks, Ray. Right, we have a, a busy period coming up for us here at Redlands. Uh, Friday night, we take on Olympic at home here at Compass Grounds at 8.30 p.m. Olympic have had a topsy-turvy sort of season, but they seem to be on the ascent now. What are you expecting? Yes, yeah, so Olympic are uh, a, a club with strong tradition and consistency in the NPL. Five grand finals in a row speaks for itself, and, and they've assembled a, a strong squad this year. Uh, I expect a very, very difficult game, and I will prepare my squad accordingly for that, and hopefully we'll execute what we need to um, at 20.30 on Friday night. That's right, so that's it folks. Remember, we want as many people down here at Compass Grounds as we can, wearing their red, cheering the lads on, you do make a difference. Then following up, Tuesday night, 7.30pm here at Compass Grounds, we have our Round 7 Australia Cup game against Lions FC. So far this season against Lions, we've had a a 1-0 loss in the Kappa Pro Series. We had a 1-0 draw in the first round of the NPL. And then last Saturday, we had a 2-0 draw with them as well. So, yeah, once again, it's, we're expecting a tight game. What do you think about the Lions match? I think if you chat to Darren, he may have a, a different view, uh, such, such is the subjectivity of football. Two games we've played them uh, in the league, when it counts, there's been two draws. Both times they've come back with late equalisers, the second later than the first, and they've been reasonably close affairs. Mark, mark my words, this is not a round seven game to us. This is a cup final, as are the other three to make the national round of 32. This competition for me, when I took charge of this team, was a huge priority to make this national round. It was a goal that we all set, and it means a great deal to me. I wouldn't have come to this club if I didn't have a mentality of a winner, and the reason I took the role was one of the attributes of my players is that they're all winners. So this is a game that I'm really pleased to have lines. Again, my old club and captain, and it's a team that we will earn the right if we get into this stage to be amongst the 32 best sides in the country. And I can't wait for Tuesday night, and I'm sure that all of the other boys in the rooms behind me feel just exact, just feel just the same. Good to hear. And back to get, and once again, folks, 7.30, Tuesday night, we want as many people down here as we can. This is an important game. We need everyone here that we can cheering the lads on. And after saying all of that, there's only one thing left to say. Come on, you Reds.